Peace and love, it's Auntie Oni. How's all my beautiful children around the world, especially in Tobago? This story I'm going to tell you is about planning ahead. You know, some of you might be doing homeschool. Some of you might be going to school with masks on. But whatever you're doing, what you must do is plan ahead. You must plan to get your homework done, your lessons done. And that way, when you plan ahead and you're prepared for the next day at school, you'll have time to play all the video games and chat on the phone and whatever you want to do besides homework. All right, so this story is about three fish in a pond. You see that pond over there? Mm -hmm. Three fish. Now, one day three fish were swimming in the pond. The first fish was named Plan Ahead. The second fish was Think Fast. The third fish was Wait and See. Well, it was a bright and sunny day. They were having a wonderful time just swimming around, having a good old time till suddenly it got dark. And the three fish looked up and they saw two fishermen. The fishermen were blocking out the sun and that's why it got so dark suddenly. And then when they looked up again, they heard the two fishermen talking. Oh, look at those three fish in the pond. Why don't we come back tomorrow and cast our net and catch them? Hmm. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea if I ever heard one. Well, the three fish, they got so scared. They waited until the two fishermen walked away. The sunlight came back out. Plan ahead, she said to her two friends, I don't know about y'all, but I, 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 I'm swimming down the river tonight. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. And you know what? She took off right away. Think fast. He turned to wait and see. And he said, you know what, wait and see, they might not even come back tomorrow. And if they do, I'm sure I'll think of something really fast when the right time comes. Think fast. He thought that he could be thinking fast. So wait and see, he says to think fast. Hmm. You're right, think fast. You got a good point there. They might not even come back tomorrow. And I'll just wait and see what happens. How about that? Early the next morning, the fishermen came down to the pond and they cast their nets. Plan ahead was gone. She had swam down the river and she was way, 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 way far away from that pond. When the two fishermen pulled their nets out that pond and lifted them up into the grass, think fast, he shut his eyes, froze up, got real hard. <clears throat> he pretended he was dead. One of the fishermen looked and he picked up Think Fast. Hmm. This fish is dead. Ploop. Threw Think Fast right back in the pond. Think Fast gulped up some water. And he swam down to the river to freedom. Wait and see. Hmm. Wait and see ended up at the fish market that very afternoon. And guess what? He ended up at Miss Carol's house in Bonacord for a big dinner party. That's right. So my friends, 
in times of trouble, when the net is cast, that's time for you to do your homework. You better plan ahead or plan to think fast. <laughs> I love that story, don't you? So you plan ahead, all right? So until next time, see you later, sweet potato. After a while, honey child.